In this video geared specifically to brand managers, we're gonna be talking about MAP agreements and their effectiveness or their lack of effectiveness when it comes to protecting your brand on Amazon. And we are using all of our experience, all of the books that we wrote, all of our inside information obtained from Amazon's executives and their staff in India to help you protect your brand sales. Now, when it comes to MAP agreements, those agreements have been struck down by the United States Supreme Court. The case is called Legion, and it had to do with a leather goods company. And what the United States Supreme Court said is that the agreements are totally unenforceable except against the people or businesses that sign the agreements. Now, Amazon is taking that Supreme Court decision several steps further. If you make a complaint on Amazon, and you use the word MAP, M-A-P, your complaint will be entirely disregarded, even if the other claims in your complaint are valid and have merit. So what do you need to know? One of the most simple things you need to know is that when you are making a complaint on Amazon, do not assert a MAP policy violation. Your complaint will be ignored by Amazon staff in India. What you can do with your MAP agreements is to use those agreements to create liability through your intended distribution network so that if your supplier takes some of your products and those products end up on the Amazon marketplace, your MAP agreement, which is enforceable against whoever signed it, you can create liability or responsibility. Now, what do I mean by that? You need to be able to track your goods through your distribution channel. And if you find that one particular distributor is allowing his or her products to end up on Amazon, your contract could require that distributor, that vendor to incur the cost of protecting your brand, of removing those products from amazon.com. If you'd like to learn more about how MAP agreements can and cannot be used to protect your brand on Amazon, contact me by email, contact me by telephone for a free consultation. In advance of our meeting, we will evaluate your brand and your products and let you know, one, how many people or companies are selling your products, and number two, how we can quickly, efficiently, and cost-effectively remove those sellers from selling your products and stealing your brand sales.